for you next week, so don't miss it. On to the weather. Alexis is here this evening. Well, you've been enjoying lovely weather here while well, I've been enjoying it elsewhere, and then it's all gone wrong. Yes, it's, it's since you've come back, unfortunately. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> really, really bad. What have you brought back with you? Because well, just, it's pretty bad. Gardeners will be happy. Yeah. No Gardeners pressure. will be happy with me. Let's take a look at your lovely weather pictures. Suzanne McGowan took this photo of a rider heading into the mist at Shell Bay in Dorset. Andrew Gregory captured uh, this autumnal scene at Swanwick Lakes Nature Reserve in Hampshire. Finally, Dot Williams uh, taking this picture of rain on a rose in Thatcham in Berkshire. So complete contrast from last week. Let's take a look at the weather for the week ahead because we had some persistent rain today and that rain will stay with us during the first part of tonight and through the first part of the week, really, we'll have rain or showers at times, the risk of thunder tomorrow, but drier and brighter with high pressure building during the middle part of the week. So overnight tonight, some heavy rain at first and that's up until around midnight when the rain will clear away, but there is still a Met Office warning up until 10 p.m. this evening. We could still have localised flooding from heavy rain. Still the risk of the odd shower, a very mild night to come with hill mist in places, lows of 15 to 16 Celsius. And tomorrow after a dry start, the showers will start rolling in from the south. We could have rumbles of thunder and lightning as well. Temperatures very similar to today. There will be some drier interludes in between the two bands of showers moving up from the south. Temperatures up to around 17 to 18 Celsius. Now the showers will continue on and off through the early hours of Wednesday morning. So Wednesday starts on a damp note with a lot of cloud around. Temperatures tomorrow night a little lower than tonight down to around 13 to 14 Celsius. So a few showers dotted about a lot of cloud to start the day, perhaps some hill mist in places on Wednesday. Drying out and improving throughout the course of the day with some sunny spells. Still a fair amount of cloud for much of the region and highs of 13 to 14 Celsius. A cooler feeling day, a breezy day, the breeze coming in from the northwest, drawing in that cooler air. Looking ahead to Thursday, high pressure starts to build up from the south. We'll have a settled day, maybe the odd isolated shower, but some sunny spells. And then this deep area of low pressure is expected to nudge its way eastward through the course of Thursday but hopefully we're hoping this area of high pressure will hold on in there for the weekend and that will keep this weather front at bay. A mainly dry day on Friday, some sunny spells to be had, the winds a lot lighter than Wednesday and looking ahead to the weekend, at the moment it should be mainly dry, there will be some sunny spells and it will feel a little bit cooler. Sally. Thanks, Alexis. Uh, be with us tomorrow night. We're going to have our colouring books and crayons out. Find out what the story is. Half past six, BBC One. Thanks for watching this evening, though. Have a good evening. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night.